Hello everybody, this is Spooky Wit Cosplay here with um, my first ever tutorial um, on my new cam. So today we're going to talk about um, how to sew vinyl without pinning because if you put a pin in it, you will have a permanent hole. So we don't want that. So no pins. So what we're going to do um, and this is probably not the best way, but uh, this is the way I do it. So we are using a Singer um, CG590. This is my first time using this machine, and so far I like it. So let me quickly thread the needle here. All right. I am now spoiled with automatic needle threaders. You have no idea. So this machine is an old but good one. I love it so far. Singer it's machine. a heavy-duty and I call it Sephiroth because I am a big fat nerd. So, what we're going to do here, if you can see, here's your vinyl strip. What we're going to do is going to be making belts for uh, for Fang's um, boots. So, we're going to be making belts like this. So, what we're going to do is you're going to want to... I have a nice marker here that goes between the pins of of the presser foot to help uh, guide me where I want my needle. Now what's cool about this machine is it has a needle position so you can have middle, right, or left and right now I have it on the far right to help get a nice uh, close edge to what I want. So what you're going to do is you're going to fold them together like this in the center and since we're not using any pins we're going to use the presser foot to hold the folds in place. So Position it here very carefully. Then put your presser foot down. So you're going to want your edge of your fabric of the fold right in the center of that tine right there, just so you can get it nice and close and have a really nice, uh, really nice stitch. Now you don't want to go too fast, especially this is your first time. And this machine so far can go pretty fast. I think it has a speed setting, but I'm going to be careful and not mess with it. So here we go. You're gonna wanna, and yes, I am sewing on the floor and I am using my knee on my turtle foot. So there we go. Go here and then back it up. Lock it in place. So as you sew, remember to keep the fold right at that little, that little tine right there, right in the middle. And that way you can have a straight stitch. Um, my mind sometimes wanders a little bit, so my stitches are not always perfectly straight. But if you have your guide tape, uh, it, it helps a lot. So I just, um, and again, just a little sections at a time. It is time a more time-consuming technique, but I find that it, it just helps. And it just, some people... Um, some people like to use double-sided tape, but that you can never get rid of if you fold it like this. Um, you can also use, when putting them together, uh, you can buy these little teeny tiny um, um, clothespins. They're really tiny. You can get them in your scrapbooking section. And I have found those to be very useful as well, but for small projects really, like this, really tiny. For details. I just find that your fingers work uh, work the best. So again, just just do a little section at a time. Don't go too fast and really try hard not to get your fingers caught in the needle because that that hurts. But your foot should do. Um, uh, your, your foot would probably will help keep your finger from getting caught in there so try not to uh, get too distracted when, when you're working but it's once you get the uh, once you get the um, the rhythm down you can make pretty good little belts for any of your cosplay needs and again this isn't the best or fastest method but it, it's, it's working pretty well so and and soon I'll show you what is going to happen when you get to the end. 
We're almost there. And I messed up a little over there, but did I sew this wrongly? Keep sewing. So once you get to the end, be very careful. Uh, this machine does not have a automatic uh, needle position, so you're going to want to have it and always roll your your um, thing towards you. Lift your foot and turn. So what you do when you turn, make sure that those are still folded. Back up, go forward, and put your needle back down. Lift your foot and turn, and you are good to go again. Now remember to keep the fold where your guide is so you can have a nice straight stitch. And as I see where I messed up there, and I kind of was not keeping it on the guide. And remember, once you get a rhythm down, it goes pretty fast. But take your time, don't rush, and you should have it have it uh, done. So you guys keep sewing and keep cosplaying.